guys hey 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 welcome back to another youtube video i sound a bit hoarse my voice is kind of going away and your girl is battling a cold like everybody is sick if it's your first time here welcome my name is jay jay sparkle and if you're not so <coughs> excuse me if you're not subscribed please consider hitting that subscribe button down below um this even is not my usual chirpy videos because my voice how much has this title but i'm just like i'm gonna be doing a even routine but it's more of a sick routine like hearing for myself and baby girl while i'm recovering um in the past weekend i was very ill and when I tell you guys, I did not even have the strength to do anything. I was so, like, I took some medication and then I slept and I took something else and then I sleep. And I just remember, I just had food delivered and I eat and I go sleep. But that's the best thing, guys, because sleeping, I think, definitely helps you to recover fast. <laughs> Alright, guys, so this part of the video is being brought to you by Hohem. And guys, guess what? They sent me their iSteady V3 gimbal and this is the game changer for those who do content creation. The Hohem iSteady V3 is a newly launched AI tracking smartphone gimbal and it is a convenient tool for recording. Once you power it on, you turn on the AI feature and guys, it's ready to use. The iSteady v3 does have uh, ultra smooth three axis stabilization and that is an anti-shake system for taking steady shots it also does uses hand gestures so you can easily start and stop the ai tracking feature and that is perfect for like travel content creators if you're always on the move and it does help you to get that smooth ai tracking the remote control is also detachable and you can use that remote to power it on, to power it off and to do many other cool features. And the camera follow me all around. Me? Oh gosh. So that's the main purpose of it. So so this gimbal can be used in many ways. I even use it with FaceTime in my family members. That way they can keep in And of course, I'm using my Hohem microphone and my Hohem gimbal. So in the morning when I'm getting ready, I always do my cup of tea because that's the first thing that I need every morning. And I also pick out a Nevi snack to put in her the gimbal is also portable and foldable so it can fit in your pocket or a bag it is so lightweight guys it is perfect for on the go shooting when you're traveling you know to your vlogs or even when going on vacation so this little vlog that you guys are seeing i used both devices to create um some content and this is the hohem mic o1 wireless audio piece and this is your microphone that comes with the attachment for the camera or the phone and then you clip the little mic onto your clothes and guys i love the clean clear audio that i got with this microphone it has noise cancellation and that is perfect because as a content creation i do lots of voiceovers and sometimes you don't want to be picking up that um extra noise in the background so it is so easy to use guys you literally power it on plug it into your device and it is ready to use so i will have the link down in the description for both the gimbal and the microphone all right guys so i got home from work and so the typical thing i know for our culture is that we like to do like chicken soup, cock soup, one of those, you know, when you're not feeling well, however, my baby, I've done like the pumpkin soup or the cock soup for her several times. She'll drink it, but she's not a huge fan, so I'm not even gonna pressure her to that. But I'm gonna make one of her favorite things, which is, um, I feel like 
when you're sick you need new like proper food you need that you know that real strong jamaican food to boost back up your system because if you're not feeding your body like your immune system cannot fight the cold and the virus and whatever I don't know if it's a cold, I don't know if it's a virus, I don't know what it is, but I know that the weather... So a couple of days ago when the weather changed, um, and there was like some alert to say that there is bad air quality, I sneezed the entire day, and then Nevi started sneezing, and then her eye allergy started acting up, and then I'm just like, Lord, not right now, not right now, but it seems like, it's like either allergy or it turned into a cold, I don't know what, but I'm gonna do all the remedies that... I do when I'm sick um, mind you it's not the traditional ones because you know as a child growing up you used to get your garlic and your honey and you know those type of stuff my grandmother <coughs> used to oops here Nevi used to rub up my foot bottom all of those stuff um, Nevi is ill as well she the first sign that I can tell when my baby is sick is when she just wants to lie down if you know Nevi you know she would be all over the place running around getting into stuff and the fact that she come home and she just is like mommy i want to lie down like i just want to lie down and relax i'm like yep you're not well definitely i start on dinner i stopped at the walmart to pick up some necessities because we're trying to so i'm trying to build up my immune system and nephews as well and i'm trying to get rid of the cold at the same time so i'm gonna show you guys some stuff i picked up so I got this. I heard that black elderberry is super good for getting rid of any cold. This is the drop. This is the syrup. I don't necessarily like the gummies. So I was like, you know, why did they give me a box that so I did curbside pick up? This is why you should take your ass into the store, okay? Because why did they give me a box to open already? Let me see if it's tampered with. Because if it's tampered with, I'm bringing it right back. Okay, it's not. They're lucky because I was going to bring it back. So this is it it's a syrup elderberry for nephew it's kids it says advanced immune support with vitamin c for kids two years and older so this should help um what else did i get <clears throat> oh guys i'm not telling you everybody's sick i got this for my neighbor this is um i got eye drops for me still because her allergy act you know a matter of fact she'll probably soon come over i should call her and tell her I reach home now um these no, these are vapor pads. So this is the Equate vapor pad. So if you have like a, like the plug-in for the wall or the humidifier, or is that the correct name for it? You basically insert these. I love these. Mind you, they have different scents. They have like a um, lavender one and so forth. I can't manage the lavender. The lavender is too strong for me. So I use the menthol vapors. Guys, drop any tips, any recommendations, anything you have for me that you would recommend me to try because I am def I am just like, I want this cold to wrap up. Like, this is getting beyond. It was so bad last night, I had to use my inhaler. And if you have to use my inhaler, y'all know it's like really, really bad. I got these. These are the puffs for my, for my nose. It's all the nasal dripping. This is the one scented with fix. I love these because it smells of like eucalyptus. Okay. So this now is something I'm trying for the first time. I've never tried this, but I've seen good recommendations on it. This is the immunity defense shot booster. So this now is supposed to take one. This has ginger, turmeric, can't pronounce that. Etchinic, acerola, cherry, can't pronounce that. Like, all right, guys, let's take a shot. So this is a defense shot. Let's see how this goes, if I like it. Lord, please don't make it taste too bad. This is what it's saying. I don't know, I don't know. I hope it's not too bad. Oh, I'm scared, I'm scared. All right, guys. Let's see what this tastes like. Let's do this. Oh. used to blend bitter bitter for you when you were younger you can't drink this okay so what does this taste like 
either the turmeric or the ginger or probably it's the black pepper when something burns i guess it's the i guess it might i don't know guys does turmeric burn i don't know if turmeric burns but something burns but especially if your throat is sore i would recommend this because it burned but it felt good you know that little tingle so this is a defense immunity defense shot i'm gonna buy some more of these and once i'm sick i'll take some shots of these to help build up my immune system i chose this because it's no added sugar all right guys i'm gonna jump straight into cooking right now i feel like I'm tired. I'm tired and I'm not feeling good. It's like the worst combination. Like, guys, I wish, I wish, I wish I was coming home to dinner already. Be like, here, sweetie, here's dinner. You're not feeling well. Go rest. Come. Would be nice. You know what? I'm going to keep saying my prayers and I'm going to keep praying to God that God will send me the right one one day. <laughs> but for now, let's shift into I'm a strong, independent woman. I got this. Let's go, guys. <laughs> Hi, guys. Yeah, mommy, me. We just come on. Um, Dilipi, Palapa, Kilipi, Drilipi, Shalapa, Rilipi, Dilipi. Walapa. So, as when I was younger, I used to hear the older kids talk in. Mommy, what is this called? What's this called? Gypsy Slippy. Um, I used to hear the kids talk in Gypsy, and you know they talk in Gypsy when they don't want the younger kids to hear. So then, as you get older, you learn it. I don't know, guys. Did you learn this as like when you were a kid? Like your older cousins, they teach you. Mommy, who taught you? Ta Mommy, talk, talk it up, talk it up English, though. No. Talk it up. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, it was some boys when we were coming from school. Mm -hmm. I couldn't talk it, and they could, and so they they taught me how to to talk in it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, mm -hmm. guys, we have to be talking in code now because I have to be careful. <laughs> mommy, the, and mommy, I think my cousin taught me the short one. So there's a long one, the short one, and I learned the short yes, one. Yes, yes. Yeah, so the short one is. Oh, no, no, you say it wrong. Yes. Wait, you said it wrong, mommy. Yes. No, that's not the short oh. one. No, the short one is. Me pee the pot, no po, hop out to put a pocket pit. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. <laughs> guys let me know do you talk any so it's just like is it like a code word it's like code mommy like a code language is that what it is yeah once you learn the format then it will be good enough okay guys do you talk anything like this in your own country because i wonder if like other caribbean countries do this too so the short one is is a lot of eyes right mommy and a lot of peas i think so right now I can talk to mommy freely and my mommy pretty soon and maybe soon catch on to this because she's so smart she's gonna catch on to she's yeah, gonna catch on to the language yeah I come mommy I pick up I pick up some I pick up some medicine um I'm gonna cook some food you know it's a set a timer for thirty minutes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Alright guys, so this is the dinner. I did dumpling and this is the curry chicken with chickpeas and some fruits for Nevi. Guys, this is a couple days later and let me tell you, I thought I was feeling bad that day when I came home from work. That was the calm before the storm because when I tell you, this call, it licked me for six. Oh my gosh, guys. When I tell you I have been, used, I've had to be using my um, inhaler back to back to back. And I was just so weak for a couple of days. Like, Nevi, oh, look at Nevi showing her cute little hairstyle because <laughs> I did her hair. And look how her Nevi hair is growing, guys. I just cannot believe it's so long and pretty. But, anyways, guys, as I was saying, um, I 
when I tell you that this call, it had me down for like over a week. And Nevi quickly recovered. But me now, oh my gosh, I could just not get over it. Um, but the call got better, but it was just that my chest was still tight. So I still had the asthma attacks going on. So, you know, I had to be taking care of that. And on this specific day, I think this was a Sunday, and I was not feeling to go cook. So I was like, you know what, let me order something online for baby girl and I. And then I quickly, you know, decided to go take a bath before I go on the road. What? While we were sick, you know, I was cleaning, sanitizing the place because, whoo, child. Good. Thank you. No Alright, let's just double check what we got here. Guys, let me tell you, the day I recorded this video, I was MIA after because I had no strength at all. I was like literally in survival mode trying to get through the days. And you know, I got some little soup and all of that to, for Nevi and I to enjoy for dinner. <laughs> 